this is what we're going to go over real quick. All right. So I know we used this last time, uh, the compactor and the dissolution dissolver through alchemistry to make uh, vibranium. But we made enough vibranium, vibranium to make ourselves a vibranium chicken. So now that we have a vibranium chicken, we don't really need to use that for that. So we have plenty of vibranium because we've been playing for a little bit, right? So not a big deal. Uh, everything's generating. However, in between streams, I went ahead and set up another uh, beet farm. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why beets, right? And it's the same thing as we have over here, right? So they're the same thing. Um, they're just going to make that. And I have it tied in to the red chest, which is the same as this red chest, which is tied to our um, wheat over here because I want to kind of keep it as small as possible so I just put a chest and a whole bunch of stack upgrades and everything on here um, you can see that it has zero current beats because currently the beats are getting um, dissolved um, and the reason why they're getting dissolved is because if you follow with me right we can take the beats bring them down here into a crafter send them into the crafter when this gets full, it's just going to back stuff into that that really, really, really voided barrel. So we will have absolutely plenty of room for beets. Anyway, when the level goes below 100 sulfur, it will emit a signal and it'll turn this on. Okay, this will craft it into red dye. The red dye will then be pulled out using this little guy here. The item card set for a counting filter of 64. I just set it that way. And it's going to pull it out on the white channel. Then the white channel is going to push down into here and it's going to dissolve it into mercury sulfide. Mercury sulfide then gets pulled back up and then sent over here into the compactor. And the compactor then makes the target, which is sulfur. And it's two for one. So then the sulfur gets pulled back into here, pulled back across, goes up into here and then it gets pulled out using a import bus into our system. So basically we turned beets into dye, into sul or magnesium mercury sulfide, back into sulfur, and then imported it back into our system. So that's how we made sulfur. Um, it's probably the most, realistically, the most efficient way. I mean, it's. I think the the only thing that's going to slow us down is this this process. And if we need to make another one, we can make another one. It's not a really big deal. But yeah, beats to sulfur. Can't beat can't beat that. Um, and no, I don't feel bad about what I've done. Why is it running though? Oh, it's because it's got a backstock. Even though I told this to stop, it still has all of these. It's going to run until these are done. Okay, because I do have the level emitter, and it's got to have a redstone signal. So. Redstone signal on to activate. It's not going to run until it's under 100, and then it'll run, it'll make it, and then it'll all go. So it's going to be going for a little while with the backlog that's already in here that I already created with all of this. So anyway, there's that. So now we have sulfur. Now let's go on down here to where we were working to see what we can make. Um, we can get rid of this bit of chat, I think. Here we go. Refresh chat and get rid of that guy's little blah 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 hopefully no looks like it's gonna stay on the stream that's fine anyway uh, I, I'm a small streamer I don't I don't need any uh, help when it comes to getting promoted by bots but I appreciate your bot body body uh, efforts so we're gonna get back into the goal of making some sulfuric acid so we need sulfur dioxide sulfur dioxide comes from a chemical oxidizer so we need to make a chemical oxidizer let's look at the chemical oxidizer chemical oxidizer um looks like we got to teach it some stuff personal chest we can make it but let's teach it so you're going to learn how to make one of these and you need to learn how whoa that's not what we want we need to teach you how to make these and we should be able to just throw you in here 
go down to the bottom ish like that and then oh and let's say give me one so we got one we're gonna make another one ahead of time so we're gonna say cool um you're doing your thing to make as much water vapor as you can so let's put this we can put it right here like realistically it doesn't matter where it goes um you're gonna need the sulfur so we're gonna have to get a what is it importer exporter an exporter to pull out of our system I like the idea of how are you already configured input basically everywhere neat so we're gonna put you on the top why not let's get a cable Right, and we're gonna get you some power. Okay, and let's grab some sulfur. Acceleration cards. So we want to say the top can be input, dark red, that's fine. And then, where are we at here? Sulfuric acid, sulfur trioxide, sulfur dioxide, sulfur dust. Oh, whoops. Can't do that. We're going to have to put you inside of, you got to make a thing. Um, where, oh, where did my brain go? Oh. Do we have a crusher? I think we have a crusher. Yeah! So, we gotta teach you the crushing thing. So, crush. Um, sulfur dust. Chemical injection chamber, no. The crusher can't do it. Hold on. Give me that. <gasps> what? That's not even cool. Wait a second here. You're telling me that I have to use a chemical injection chamber, which means I'd have to get hydrogen chloride. To be able to do this, or... I mean, I could use a pulverizer. Let's do that. I haven't taught this thing anything from thermal. We have never touched thermal in this whole pack. So, looks like we're gonna have some fun with some thermal. Uh, thermal, um, I think I taught it everything. Let's go see. Okay. 
Can we make a pulverizer now? Yep. All right. Now let's make some upgrades for it. Uh, we're probably going to need to get the induction smelter. And that shouldn't be too hard. Invar gear. Oop. So we got to teach it Invar. Oop. Ran out of. Let's see here. Blast furnace. Teach you that. <clears throat> you know how to make most of the rest of this stuff. Invar, though, is a challenge in its own. We can teach you to smelt it, and we can teach you to make the dust, like so. And then we can teach you with the dust and making the dust. You can make the dust. I have to teach the pulverizer the different tests. So let's go ahead and set down our pulverizer. Um, yeah, we could put him right here. Just like that. And put you back there. Okay, so we need a mega pattern provider. Mega Pattern Provider. And we need a... No, oh, we already got cables. What up, cables? Neato. Cool. And so in this one, we need to teach you that. No, not that. Dang it. Give me that back. Okay. Um, actually, you don't need to know that. You just need to know how to make the other dusts. So you need to make iron dust and nickel dust. So I got to teach you iron dust and nickel dust. So iron dust. You know already know iron dust. So nickel. Nickel dust. Meh. Do we want to use a pulverizer? We can do that. Crap. Get a pattern. So if I do that, now you know how to do that, and I can technically just throw you in there for the time being, make my life a little bit easier later. Okay, so I can throw you in the crafters. So this is how you make the dust. This is how you make the induction smelter. This is how you make the Envar gear. That's how you make that. That's how you make Envar dust. No, that's a that's a cooking pattern. Cooking pattern goes in here. Okay. And did I teach you? I think I taught you Envar dust. So I should be able to make an induction smelter. All right. Missing sand. Thought I had sand automated. Oh, it's because we broke it for the uh, the hauntingness. Okay, well, I got more sand anyway. OK, 
Okay, make me an induction smelter. Oh, I haven't set the side configuration. I was like, why is it not working? Do I need to upgrade your speed? We're missing gold nuggets. How could we miss gold nuggets? I should fix our gold problems. All right, so um, lost my train of thought. Oh, we need um, speed upgrades. There, now you should be fine. Yeah, and. I'm just going to ask for this thing to make enough uranium where I ain't got to deal with it. So just stop. <laughs> Alright, um, that's good, that's good. So do we have an induction smelter now? We do. Cool. We're going to put you here. And we're going to teach you that also give you power and we're gonna get a mega pattern provider just like I saw and then teach you that grab a cable case we need more than one we shouldn't cool and now that ties into there <laughs> all right should be fine I don't know how many channels we're currently at let's see how many channels I don't want to mess up our channels 16 6 yeah we're fine everything's fine I don't know why we're worried about channels. Like, we literally have an unlimited amount of channels, like, right here. All right, anyway, um, you've got power, you've got that, you've got your mega pattern providers. So now we can actually look at getting some of the upgrades for um, the different tiers of thermal. So at thermal, uh, let's see, what are they called? So we can do these here, right? to go okay here we are so this is eight this is 12 right so I think we're gonna go ahead and make that one so to make this one we're gonna need a boatload of patterns so let's go ahead and make some patterns cool we already got plenty that's wonderful so let's get started we're gonna say that's how you do that and Here's that. There's that. So that's how you make those. Clay. Um, sure. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. Um, so that's that, that's that, that's that, that's that. You don't know how to make this. Now you do. And now you need to know how to make this. So we got, we taught it that. We got to teach it this. Which is that. Gold dust, I think we know. Who knows gold dust? You know gold dust. Thank you. 
so everything looks pretty good all the way down to the weird nuggets so boop this is all taught boop that's taught that's taught this has got to be taught right so we have it should be one two three four right one two three cool and then this one is the start of the next one so that's this one so now we got to teach it eyes of ender enderium gears and this one so boop boop eyes of ender these weird gears okay boop boop or those things these things and then that's it for this one okay so we can move on to this one and that's pretty simple right and boop 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 to make this one we gotta make the lumium gears we gotta teach you how to make lumium too there it is okay let's go back down the rabbit hole electrum no we went too far too far down the rabbit hole we ain't ready for that rabbit hole yet enderium ingots we gotta teach you enderium ingots okay boop 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 okay so that's that so we taught it this this look this glass um, induction smelter easy and then we got to teach you oh, that's not what we want that's not what we want come on boop 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 we didn't I just need hardened glass induction smelter hardened glass easy peasy okay and we're now all the way down to here and now we got to teach it electrum and signalum so boop 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 so we taught it all of this yep electrum so we need we could teach it electrum first so that should be right here just a lack of so and then signalum which is this one and we're gonna keep going electrum signalum signalum gear and so we got that we got that we got that we got that now we got to teach it this one and we're doing this completely backwards from the beginning completely backwards is it that neat uh, Invar we it already knows Invar it already knows gold gears it should know how to make glass so realistically I think if we hold down shift we should be good to go but just dropping these directly in to where they got to go so let's go over here to this guy and we know that your processing pattern, 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 crafting, 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 processing, processing, crafting, 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 crafting. Cool. So there's all that. And you will now live starting here K 
can we make this? I don't know. I don't think we even have shulker shells. So we probably won't make shulker shells. Past the shulker shells. Um, so at thermal, let's see here. Let's make, let's see. We only need two for now. We're missing diamond dust. So I gotta teach the pulverizer the diamond dust. So So, not you, you. Let's go ahead and see if you can do an endurium. Let's get rid of that. What? Which one's this? It's hardened. We don't want hardened. We want, I think, the four times? Because we can't do this one yeah we're missing two shulker shells and prismarine so we can do I can't believe this is still going it shouldn't be going And it's going to take a little while. I think there's also uh, Thermal has other things that'll help with this too, like these augments. So A U G. There we go. And I think that some of these augments make these things go much faster. So like this is the one that we got. It's four times faster. But there's another augment that we're I'm looking for. Um. Yeah, that's one we want. E. Oh, there it went. Increases processing speed. Oh, you're painfully slow. Oh, and it requires Electrum. And we already have this guy just screaming. come back to this anyway we've got our our ability to call for the dust as we need it so we can go back over here to our our regularly scheduled panic mode and we'll come back to that later like I said some of these things are going to take a little bit longer than normal so let's get back down here and get back after it so you needed sulfur dust right we, we can do an importer and import sulfur dust directly into here. No, it'd be an exporter, not an importer. Exporter. Math. Boop, 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 boop. Cool beans. I can just, I think you already have that. Oh, you already got one. I already thought of this. Sulfur, and grab that. Put you here and then get rid of one, just one, and make a crafting upgrade. And we already have one, so that's good. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Where's the wrench? 
this little guy here is my favorite little friend when it comes to this because he can just boop it off just like that so put a crafting upgrade and you can say input on top great to know that you listen input on top oh cool there now that's going to run incessantly until it gets enough sulfur dioxide and then sulfur dioxide has to go through another one of these right so we're going to put this guy you know what we're going to put them face to face just like that and then I'm gonna grab you and we're gonna grab you and we're gonna slide you in there and everything's gonna be groovy so we're gonna say you're gonna be pulling you're gonna be ejecting output right okay I think that's right so you're gonna be pulling from the left outputting to the right automatic on gases input nice and you're going to have gases output right, auto eject on. You should be getting, hold on, am I doing this right? Chemical infuser. I was wrong. Chemical. We don't have a chemical infuser. Did you know you can make a chemical infuser? You do now. So, make me a chemical infuser. <laughs> it's so painfully slow. I think this thing's going to constantly run. I'm going to have to do the same thing I did before. Are you, like, stuck? We're going to cancel that. Okay. Okay. Just just make, make a lot. And we can whoosh back home okay so what's your problem what was you trying to make all right I know what I know what's wrong Okay, that's fine. You're good. All right, craft one. Now then, you should be fixed. Why are you lead, three lead, one diamond, one emerald? That'll work but you're not listening 
when I'm telling you crafting is unlocked okay go back here throw it back in Give me that. There. Now it's going to wait until it's done with that to bring in the right things and then do the right things. Thank you. And you're going to be ultra slow anyway, but at least now you'll do your job. Okay, so that's good. We can now uh, mob farm. Okay. So we're back here, chemical oxidizer. We needed to teach you how to make the next thing, which was a chemical infuser. I think we have a chemical infuser. Chemical infuser, chemical infuser. Okay, chemical infuser, plop you down. Grab this. Okay, cool. You already have your silicon dioxide. What else did you need to make silk trioxide? Oxygen? Okay, let's see here. Let's figure out oxygen. Again, deconcentrating? No. Electrolytic separator is what we need. So, did you know you can make an electrolytic separator? I'm not teaching you how to make it because I only need one. So we're going to set the electrolytic separator right here and it's going to get water and it's going to go ahead and start working. We're going to say dump excess, dump excess and you're going to need the power. And it's going to start making hydrogen and oxygen but we're going to need two um, what do we call those things? Quantum. Yeah. One, two. Well, there's one. <laughs> there's two. We don't need you right now, but we do need both of you. So, right side and left side. So you're going to be called uh, oxygen. And you're going to have oxygen. And it actually is now holding hydrogen. Right? Or are you holding oxygen? What, what are you doing? Yeah, you have hydrogen and you're going to be oxygen. And you should have oxygen. So you're going in one, you're going in the other, boom. Oxygen in the oxygen channel, hydrogen in the hydrogen channel. So then you need one of these. Now I couldn't put it over there, but we're not going to. And I can say you want for sodium trioxide, you want oxygen. So we can say oxygen channel set. And you're going to be pushing gases output left boom sulfur trioxide now um what are we doing this for um let's see here we need hydrogen chloride 
for that part. We'll get to that. Dissolution chamber. So you need sulfuric acid. Sulfuric acid. We need sodium trioxide and water vapor. So we need to get another chemical infuser. I think my other thing is done. So let's look at that. We got one. Let's make another one. Oh, I think we can just teleport back, right? Um, home. And I can just go over here, open you up, and throw you in there. And you're just going to make this a little bit faster. Actually, we don't need you in here as much we, as we need you in there. Because, geez, it took forever. Back to the mob farm. Okay. So, we should have the chemical infuser now. And we can just set you... Here, whatever, All right, and give you some power. Okay, um, and you need water vapor, so we can technically grab another quantum entangloper. Boom, boom, and we can just set you here, and we can say you want water vapor set. Because I think that's what you need on the right side. Input, yep. Input, yep. And you're going to be output. So that's fine. Okay. We need sulfuric acid, which is water vapor, and sulfur trioxide. So we need sulfur trioxide on this side. So you're making it, but you're not doing anything with it. So we're going to say you're going to push up. So now we have a sulfur trioxide channel. And then I can grab another one. Because we're just going to use them for everything. We can set you to the sulfur trioxide channel. Set. And you should be getting sulfur trioxide from the left. Right? And from the right, you should be getting the other one. And you just don't care what I'm trying to do. Right? Chemical infuser. Uh, sulfuric acid. Sulfur trioxide water vapor. So you're set to water vapor. Gases output left, fluids output left, auto eject on, auto eject on. So you now have that and we're going to say you are going to output right, output right, output right, on, on. I hear you running. Then there's our sulfuric acid. Congrats for us. We now have sulfuric acid because I just don't want to have to wait on stuff. So I went through a long way. So now we can grab this, put you on top, or the front. I, you know what? I like the idea of on top. That's not what we wanted. Where'd it go? There it is. Okay. What? There we go. We're going to say you're going to output top. And you are now going to be sulfuric acid channel. Oh, there we go. 
And now we can get into the actual or duplication process. So that's just one thing for us to be able to do. And the or multiplication thing, I got to go and look at. It should be in the quest. So basic power, we got something. Ooh. A lantern of paranoia. I do not think I want to play with that mystical agriculture. We got something. What else did we get? Mechanism. Enrichment chamber. So. Throw all this stuff back in here. Oh, this thing's neat. I just realized what that is. That's super cool. Um, we don't really need it though. Um, let's see here. So it says we need an enrichment chamber. I think enriching factory. Yeah, that's what we got. So did we already put one back here? Compressing factory. Yeah, that's for that. So let's continue. Uh, what we got going on? Over here. So boom. On. And we're going to ulti till ulti tier you already. Because I can. So green to red to blue to purple. We're getting close to maxing out this card. That's fine. Okay, so you're good. So if I grab from our chest, it our orange chest should have. Let's see here. We should be able to just pop back. And check our orange chest. Well, I don't think we really needed to bother if we would have been patient. <laughs> oh well. Mob farm. So I should just be able to throw you guys in there. So that's the first step, right? In this. Right? Is enrichment. Oop. So we enrich it, then electrolytic separator it. I mean, we can make another enrichment factory just to be able to complete the quest, whatever. I think it's because I made the basic enriching factory. It just it bypassed it. Yeah, I'm sure you're just gonna grab them. All right, let's throw all this junk back in. Right. Okay. Um, purification. So I think it says the purification purifiers are ores, which turns one raw ore into two clumps. Then it can be sent through the crusher and turned into dirty dusts. Then sent through an enrichment chamber. So I kind of messed up. Whatever. So we're going to go ahead and make the rest of this stuff. It doesn't matter. I mean, realistically, I can just go make the chicken now. So where's my smelting factory? Just do that. That is the most I've ever seen of this. But we're trying to get it automated so we can just make a chicken.
Maybe we'll just throw the last one in. Um, we're going to abandon abandon hope with that and see if we can just grab a chicken. So let's grab our net. Ooh, that can help us speed up some processes. There we go. And you should catch back up. Yep, all right, cool. Um, oh, we can probably get this going too. Let's go ahead and teach this thing real quick to make that, that, Sure, that, and that should be as easy as just slotting these in here. And then telling it um, to craft flux linkage amplifiers. And we want six. Do I need to teach this thing how to make flux hammers? I mean, the hammer. I think I should. Sometimes I just forget that I need to teach it a couple of things here and there. So there's six of these. That's pretty quick. Um this way. So that should make you, yeah, look at that. Just screaming through these things. Cool. If we go grab some more stuff, I'm going to be easier. All right. So, um, lost interest in all of this because we're just going to go get a chicken. So the overall goal for today was to get the dimensional shark card. Right, this thing, and get that. So let's go grab a, at resource for chickens. Grab us a chicken catcher. We're down to two chickens. We need seeds. What? How do we not have seeds? I feel like my farm up here is like off the network because like oh crap these aren't locked oh no um at functional we need that and this and we're gonna have to fix this because this should have been locked. Okay, now we need to lock this. Lock that, lock that, lock that, lock that, lock that. Now we should have plenty of seeds again. Ah, that was trash. I got done dirty with that one. And now to go, yeah, ooh, I can actually sl slide through there. Make Zimkis look away. Okay. And now we need the unobtainium. Grab a stack. And Z chicken. 
and I kind of got rid of the little cage thing that I was using to hold him over here. He won't get away. We'll be fine. He's still chicken. Don't run away, chicken. You just be real still. I'm just force feeding you ingots, shoving them in your poor little mouth. Congratulations. We bypassed having to deal with that. Um, and you can go here. You're my new friend. You're looking the wrong way. You know what? You're being weird. I don't like it. Have some seeds, bud. Get the Seed Shooter 900. Rippy McSkippy them seeds. Anyway, so he's going to do his job. I think this is going to shoot him with seeds eventually. I guess it's going to do these guys first. They're a little low on the seeds. Yeah, it's round robin in, so it'll work out. Um, so anyway, he'll get his seeds. He'll start producing unobtainium. We have lots. I'm not going to get the seeds. I don't care for them. Um, and we've got to make the alloys, but I'm not sure how this works. I gotta get a piglitch heart, or I could do it on. No, it looks like. I can do it using power. That's neat. So that's done. So can I get a dimensional card now? Enderium plates and in ender, ender pearl dust. So I need enderium plates. Okay. I think this is just going to eat that forever. Waiting patiently. Hello, Diamond Dust. How come? What are you doing? So you now have four, there's two, we need a lot more, you know what, I can just, I don't know why I'm not doing this, Actually, I don't need this. Well, I need these two. And these are both crafting patterns, so they can just be shoved into our crafter. Ender pearl dust. So, how do we do that? Pulverizer. No, that's not what we want. That's what we want. So let's see if we can do it now.
And we'll be back here in a little bit with more of this after it gets done.